Hey YouTube, this is Trains and Destinations, and in today's video we're going to do a quick troubleshoot on this HP laptop. Now, this is actually a common problem with HP laptops. I've tried out a couple and this is a pretty common issue. So typically what will happen is that you will go ahead and you'll update your graphics, whether through Windows Update or the uh, HP Update system, and that would be this, the Radeon graphics uh, that affects the screen. And at least in my case, sometimes after I update the graphics driver, you won't be able to adjust the brightness on the screen. And um, on my camera, it looks like the screen is flickering. It's not actually flickering. It's probably a difference between the refresh rate between the screen and my camera. Um, I'm not sure if this will appear on video, but if it does, I do apologize. But again, there's nothing wrong with the computer screen. It's just a difference between the refresh rate of the display and of my phone. So anyway, so as you can see, when I adjust the brightness, this is at max brightness, but yet, as you can see, the brightness does not change whatsoever. It's a little blurry. But as you can see, though, the brightness is not changing at all, despite me, as you can see, I'm moving it from all the way down, all the way up, down, and up. The brightness doesn't change at all. So when that happens, again, this typically will happen after you do a graphics update for some reason, and this is a common fault with HP laptops. Um, what you'll want to do is that you'll want to uh, grab this. So this is called the HP Collaboration Keyboard. If you just type that in on Google Search or Bing Search, it'll come up to the official HP customer support page, and this will allow you to download the software, which is called the HP Collaboration Keyboard Software. And this will allow you to enable the brightness controls again so you can adjust the brightness. As you can see, again, it won't adjust. So you wanna go ahead and download the HP Collaboration Keyboard, and this has happened with a few HP laptops I've had, and usually after downloading this, it will fix the problem. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and save it. So I'm gonna go ahead and skip ahead to when it's fully downloaded. Okay, so once it's been downloaded, um, you'll have this little message pop up asking you if you want the app to allow changes to your device. Of course, you click yes, and then you go through this, you accept the license agreement, you hit next, next again. And then you'll just go here through the setup wizard. Just go through it as fast as possible. Um, between this, I would just go with complete, I think. All right, so there we go. So this will install some extra features they might not use because this is meant more for business laptops than for people who need uh, special software related to that. But again, this should fix the keyboard brightness issue. So, you know, it, it is what it is. Okay, so now you click finish. All right, and then once it's finished, what you need to do is restart the laptop. Um, it won't work right after you download the software. Uh, you do have to go ahead and restart your laptop once you're finished downloading. So we'll go ahead and do that. All righty, so the laptop is now reset. It's turned on again. I restarted it. And here's the moment of truth. And there you go. It works. Works perfectly. As you can see, from max brightness to minimum brightness. And so that's all you have to do. That's all you have to do. And just to show you, I have it here in my downloads. There you go, the SP94943. So there, there you go. So if you ever have an issue for your HP laptop where for some reason the brightness controls stop working, you just go in, you go and download the HP Collaboration Keyboard software. Once it's downloaded, you reset your laptop and you're all good to go. So, thank you for watching.